Hey, Trendies, Trendsetters, and my Trendy Tribe. First of all, thank you for my birthday wishes through all the channels. I appreciate it. Um, still celebrating, but had to take a quick break to address this court date coming up with Martel and Melody. Also, please keep an eye out for my community tab tomorrow. There will be a post that hopefully most of y'all will see. Um, it's important. I just don't know, <clears throat> excuse me, the tone it will have until after later on tomorrow. So, but please keep your eye out for the community tab for a post for me. Um, okay, so this Martel and Melody case. <sighs> Y'all, these are all theories, right? Because I, I don't have any, uh, I don't know anybody out there personally that's connected to the case. So this is all guesses, right? So I'm going to tell you my guesses and I'll tell you why this is my guess. The first thing I think that this is not to do with the revenge P plot yet. I feel like some things have probably, of course, been filed, but I don't think this is it. And the reason I don't think it's it is because one, it, it still says Melody Sheree Holt instead of Melody Sheree Rogers. I do believe that Melody will file under Rogers, not Holt, when she addresses that revenge P plot. That's my opinion. I also see the case number has 2020 in it, um, which to me says this is a carry on of when Martel took Melody to hold, uh, Melody to court for the child custody or whatever else he thought he was going to get that he didn't get. And so that 2020 year, which I think that's the year in a case number, also tells me this is a carryover from the past. I think that we'll see a 2022 or 2023 uh, when Melody does take him to court. Um, so I don't think this is related to the revenge P. However, I'm frustrated with him that there's even a reason he has the nerve to still be in court on anything, knowing what he's allegedly done. <clears throat> the nerve is real. Um, now here's the thing though. Do y'all think he'll actually show up? Or is he feeling the heat enough knowing what's coming for him that that part will be dropped and he'll be a no-show? Also, we know he doesn't really have funding. At least it seems he has no funding. So he'll be in there probably representing himself and that shouldn't last long that way either. But I'm like, what more could he need? Is it, is it a, do you think it's a court order from the judge as a follow-up of how things are going after she ordered all that stuff as far as seemingly with the, the Eminem kids can't be on social media. Um, the, I don't know. The cussy dates were settled because I remember Melody said she's happy that it's still what it is. She's fine. That's, that was fine with her. At least, it, you know, it could get settled. What do you think that they're back in court for? I personally don't think it's the revenge P yet, but I think he is certifiably out of his mind. If he actually is trying to bring anything else up and with the hot water that he is in, like you, oh, I'm tired of seeing his name, except when I need to see his name as a defendant for the alleged crimes that this man has committed. I, that's all I want to see his name for. Um, but yeah, let me know your thoughts and theories. But since it doesn't say Rogers and then that court case number is showing me it just looks like it's something from the past i just think it's something else for this time whatever it is i'm sorry i i hope uh well not i'm sorry i just hope melody gets whatever she needs to get and get another part of that in the past for her and out of her plate this is ridiculous but let me know what y'all think talk to you later bye Take it